but the opportunities are endless right now. Lights, camera, action. If these are words you've always wanted to hear during your workday, Winnipeg may be the place to be. Industry leaders are predicting a massive spike in demand for people who want to work in the movies. You know that hockey stick effect in terms of growth? It, it's exponential in terms of the, the potential that this industry has. And the key to that is continuing to build our labor force. Due to the streaming revolution caused by the pandemic, where people consumed more entertainment at home instead of going to the cinema, the demand for content has skyrocketed, and many people say Winnipeg is well positioned to take advantage. Streamers have, streamers have gone ballistic through the roof in terms of their demand for content. You've got Apple, you've got Paramount Plus, you've got HBO Max, You, I could go on and on. So the demand for content is going to continue to be extremely strong. When you walk, walk like a man with answers. Ian Dimmerman is one of the folks behind projects like CBC's The Porter and the recent feature-length film Percy starring Christopher Walken. Got my own seeds. He says the recent launch of a new production studio and the introduction of direct flights between LA and Winnipeg allow for more content to be made right here. As projects ramp up, local crews are being kept very busy and demand on a skilled workforce is only growing. I would say that the gap will only continue to widen. Recently opened Big Sky Studios has two sound stages, a mill and paint shop and wardrobe spaces. Jocelyn Mitchell is one of the folks behind Big Sky and when asked how quickly they're looking to expand the film labor force in the province, her answer was simple. I think immediately. I mean, we're hoping to uh, be ready at the end of this month to have shows going in our building. But even outside of us, I know there's an immediate need right now. We're bringing people in from other provinces to take on some of these roles when we can't find people locally. She says right now there's serious momentum in the industry. Production volume recently reached record levels, but says that momentum will require people to sustain it. It does feel like a turning point right now. It feels like all of the pieces are starting to come together. If we can get... Um, you know, the crew base to continue to grow. I think we are looking at sort of the next phase of production in Manitoba. Manitoba Film and Music, which promotes Manitoba to filmmakers around the world, says the new studio will help demand and employment grow and become more consistent. We're always in need of more people, and so that pressure is uh, is getting to the point where uh, we know that uh, we need big numbers to enter the industry, and I believe we, we're in need of hundreds, if not north of a thousand more people uh, to enter the industry. He says his group is one of the many working to bolster the workforce to ensure the city can accommodate even larger scale productions. He says as the market becomes more established, it allows the labor force to do the same. Folks would enjoy being in Winnipeg, love their hometown to work in the industry, but still we're going to Toronto, Vancouver to have that permanent role at a more senior level. Now they can work here year round. In Winnipeg, Morgan Majeski, City News.